The ones we call the president must live their lives in balance. We know their politics, but not so much about their talents. Like Washington was a killer on the dance floor in his day. Jefferson was an architect, designed buildings his way. Jackson was a crack shot, dueled a hundred times and lived. Tyler played the violin performances he'd give. Folk skill and oratory is how he got the votes. Pierce's amazing memory, his speeches used no notes. Lincoln's skill at wrestling, he seldom lost a fight. Garfield and the Dexterous, with both hands he could write. Still, that spending had made 80 suits to wear. Roosevelt walking on stilts got his whole plan up there. Wilson's golden tenor voice in every song he does. Harding could play nearly every instrument there was. Hoover's was songwriting, wrote one while in Australia. FDR screenwriting credit for his idea. Truman played piano, though he'd say not that well. Mike's was painting, made 300 works, though not to sell. LBJ bought a radio station, could be LDJ. Keyboard, sax, violin, and clarinet, Nixon could play. Ford modeled in his late 20s for some magazines. Reagan, a sportscaster for the radio broadcast scene. Carter speed reading 2,000 words per minute max. Clinton skilled at crossword puzzles and could play the sax. Bush loved oil painting to avoid getting bored. Obama's narrating of his book won an award.